Hey everybody, I'm coming to you with a video on what hair is and what it means to me. Y'all have to excuse me because I'm outside right now and the wind is blowing a little bit. So if you hear any noise and you see my hair flying in the wind, you know why. Um, but I just want you guys to know what I feel hair is and what it is to me. So hair to me is more than just an accessory. Hair to me, it means so, so, so much more hair is literally i'm not sure if most people know this a part of your nervous system yeah you can go ahead and google it and let me know what you find hair is literally a part of your nervous system and it's like antennas so you're wearing basically antennas you go into a room and your hair scans the environment that you're in have you ever heard the saying um the hair stood up on the back of my neck why do you think your hair did that because it scanned the room and it put you in a position to where you should know whether to do whether to flight whether flight or flight is necessary your hair has a job your hair has a purpose and it's more than just something that we do every morning it's more than something that we color it's more than something that we cut it's more than something that we just style we are here for a reason and every single part of our body is the way it is for a reason and nothing about us, because we are amazing, we are gods, nothing about us is just by chance or just here, just to be here. So it's our job to find out um, why each part of our bodies and organs um, are the way they are and what it is that we should be doing to protect them and to take care of them. And one of those things is our hair okay and I'm very serious about my hair I don't like people touching my hair <laughs> uh, like I go to a grocery store and people are like oh my gosh is that your hair can I touch it no you cannot I'm sorry my hair has a purpose and my hair is just it's like I said it's an antenna it's a part of your nervous system literally so if I wouldn't want you touching my nerves inside my body I don't want you touching my hair so we have to think about those things when we um, are styling our hair. When we think of hair, it should be more than just a necessary, something for us to do. We get up mad because we got to do our hair in the morning. No, baby, no. It's more to our hair than just that. Our hair literally, I don't know if you know this, but you can Google it. Our hair literally can tell us when we have disease in our body. Did you know that? Dis-ease, meaning our body is not at ease. Okay, which usually means when people just say, you know, you're sick, you got disease, you got this, you got that. This ease is dis, slow it down, dis ease. Your body is not at ease. And you can tell that, I'm not saying the only way to tell, but you can actually tell what's going on in your body by your hair. Have you ever known someone who who's balding? Out of nowhere, they just get bald spots. Nothing happened. Hair wasn't too tight. Braids didn't just snatch them out. They just started getting bald spots. And then they are more tired and they don't feel like themselves anymore. Yet their hair gave them an indication that there was dis-ease. The body's not at ease. Okay? So, and depending on the bald spots or depending on the loss of hair um, on your head, where it's at, it may be the front, it may be the the edges it may be in the back it may be on the crown depending on where you're losing the hair it's connected to an organ and that is telling you hey this organ is weak we need to up the minerals we need to up the vitamins okay so your hair is amazing and we don't even know it we sitting here mad that we got all this hair are we sitting here mad and cutting our hair off because we just don't feel like doing it? Our hair is here for a reason. Every single part of our body is here for a reason. And we weren't taught these things. So it's our job to learn. It's our job to find out the information, do the research, and take care of ourselves. Because if we don't take care of ourselves, who else is going to do it? I'll wait. Nobody. Love you. Love every part of you from your from the crown of your head to your hair to the soles of your feet is here for a reason god made you the way he made you and you are made with a purpose it's our job to figure it out our bodies are made for a purpose and it's our job to figure out why 
okay so let me know what you think about this video because I know y'all gonna have something to say <laughs> hopefully you learned something and this is not a video to make you feel bad it's not a video to tell you not to cut your hair not to perm your hair not to color your hair not to style your hair. this is not that type of video this is a video to just I want you to be aware be aware of the God that is in you be aware of what God created and have given to you so that you can take care of it properly so that you know how to take care of it, so that you care to take care of it okay so please again comment on this video let me got let me know what you guys think um like subscribe follow me on instagram and um tiktok at classy and natural follow me on youtube at all things natural and i'll be back and i will definitely be reading the comments so let me know and i will come back with another video if you guys want another video like this um, just let me know. I'm all into holistic, the whole body being healed, the whole body and understanding and knowing, you know, the body and the purpose of the body. So that's what I'm on. That's what I'm about. So, you know, let me know if you want more videos like this and I will definitely do more. All right, everybody. I'll see you next time. Have a good one.